and I decided, Elizabeth, you are gonna go relaxed. So yeah, I am. Hello beautiful people, welcome to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. And if you're just stumbling upon my video for the first time, thank you for watching, thank you for, for clicking on my video. Okay. So today's video is going to be on why I relax my natural hair. My hair is relaxed. Yeah. <laughs> my hair is relaxed and it's not 100% relaxed. It's not even 80% relaxed. It's majorly text relaxed. I still have a lot of texture in my hair. I have a lot of texture and I love it because I just really wanted the texture release. I wanted to like release the texture of my hair. My hair is very thick. My natural hair, I will look for videos or pictures to put on the screen. It's very, very thick. So when I was natural, it was a struggle because, but I love my natural hair. That's a disclaimer. I love my natural hair. My natural hair was beautiful. It was flourishing. It was nice. My friends loved it. My classmates, my colleagues, every, in fact, literally everywhere I go, everyone wants to touch my hair, ask me what I use on my hair. My hair is that long. How I got that length. How I got that, that, that um, density. My hair was, was beautiful. But one thing is, I became tired and I wanted to change things. I wanted to just switch things up. I became really tired of the natural hair because it got to a time that I never had time for my hair. I finished school August. I'm a medical student and when I was in school, it was a bit, my, my, my hair was a struggle. Like, I could go months, months without making my hair. I would just pack it, just put it in eye bun. My hair was always in bun and twist. Yeah, my hair was always in twist. I was a mini twist, chunky twist, name it, any kind of twist. My hair was always in twist, if not in twist, in bun, in all this pineapple bun, low bun, eye puff, every kind of bun that you know. <laughs> so um it was really I became I became bored because I could not do any style. It was just I don't know, my hair was just all over. It was a struggle. Because I had lectures, I have class, I have so many things I'm doing. It just couldn't fit into my schedule anymore. Like it was really, really stressful. But I was, I still kept on going. I kept on going. But when it got to the, my fifth year of being natural, yeah. By the way, I was natural for five whole years before I relaxed my hair last year. So the the fifth year that was last year January, I I don't know. I just got really tired and I was thinking of, about it. I don't know if I should probably just cut the hair and start over or maybe i should relax my hair and one thing is i was relaxed to 2017 i went natural november 2017 no september 2017 so i don't know i was relaxed and my hair was full i had edges and all but i was so i was i don't know my my hair feel, i feel i felt like anytime i relax my hair i just leave it and poof it's back the way it was like i wanted my hair to be you know flowy i wanted to be sleek i thought i could only I, I thought i could achieve that with only relaxer that was what i thought so but anyways thank god for knowledge thank god for good i later found out that okay that was because i used and then i only relaxed my hair i don't deep condition i don't do any other thing I, and i just wanted to miraculously be straight i don't know where the idea came from but anyways Thank God for girls, I've, I watched, I, I, when I say watch, I mean I binge watch videos in my relaxed air and how you can take care of it, how you can grow, how it's going to be too, too hard. And I don't know, I just watched a lot of videos and I decided, Elizabeth, you are going to go relaxed. So yeah, I am. I relaxed my air. And number two was that my watch day takes long. Ah, Jesus. Wash day was literally wash day, like you use the whole day to wash your hair. Why? It got me to a point where my wash days were literally just let water touch my hair. I didn't care if I was doing it right, I didn't care if I was losing so much hair, I didn't care if I even did tangled before. I was just doing anything I wanted. And guess what? My hair started breaking. Just touching my hair, boom, it has broken. And the thing is that I, I still use the old product that is just like I wasn't too much too dedicated as I was and my started breaking, I had a lot of split ends. Then 
another thing i noticed was i was so tired of the calls it was so cold but i was so tired so i decided to like probably okay before i go natural before i go relax rather let me um sh let me try to blow dry my hair so i will blow dry or i would um flat iron the hair reverts like this it just go it just goes back to the way it was like i go back to square one there was a day I sat down and I was like, I'm cutting this hair. I am so cutting this hair. In fact, when I was natural, I felt like my hair wasn't like it. Because once I apply a little amount of it on my hair like this, it just starts to break. It starts breaking. Then I have to worry about my hair getting damaged. Like, I don't visit the salon because I feel like not all, not all hairdressers know how to handle natural hair. Definitely not. I had... An experience, a terrible experience, but let's leave that for another day with a hairdresser. Normally, I, I style hair for people. I mean, hair stylist, I like to actually like hair, anything hair I do. I love hair a lot, but and I, I make my hair myself as well. I make my hair myself, but there are sometimes that it is tiring, Jesus. It can be tiring, and sometimes I'll be so tired. I'll feel like I'm so tired, I can't make my hair myself just to condo my hair. I'll be so tired to do that. And I want someone to do it for me. But because I'm afraid that my hair might get damaged, they might pull my hair well, they might not know how to decangle it, they might pull it and just let break it. And I was just so confused. And I'll just leave my hair. And I'll just leave my hair like that. Or maybe when I when I'm less busy, I'll just probably just do two cornrows and carry it for like two weeks. Like it was that bad. And I was wearing a lot of wigs. I was wearing a lot of wigs. Anytime I, I have the time to make like probably six or eight cornrows, I will always wear, I will wear a wig that whole week. So I wear a lot of wig because I'm always on cornrows, at least to, to change my style. Then it goes to a point where I started looking unpresentable. Like everybody likes the air fine. But then the, 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 the way it was too, like, too tight, kinky, and the... Um, I don't know the fullness of the air once I when I pack it to the back, I feel like like I don't I already got used to that to that to that um look. So I I just I just feel I just feel unkept. I just started feeling unkept to that with that style. So I don't know, everything just literally I just got tired. Then another thing is um styles don't last on natural air. Oh Jesus. Styles don't last on natural air. Ordinary cornrows. I barely carry my cornrows for a week. Like I barely carry my cornrows for a week. One week like this, and my cornrows are, I don't know, everywhere. It just has in air everywhere, everywhere. Scattered rough. I cannot even carry it out. One week cornrows, cornrows of five days, and I already start looking unkept. Stuff just don't last. My hair takes long to dry. Ah, my natural. I have a low porosity hair, and my hair is really, really full and thick. Even as it is relaxed, you can see it is so full. So my hair takes long to dry. There was a time I tried doing wash and go. Oh Jesus Christ! My hair didn't dry for three days, three whole days. I I tried to do the wash and go in the evening because I know I was going to be having class the following day. I was thinking, okay, I'll use hair dryer to make it dry. I, I when I was done. The wash and go by the way it took me like hours i think probably three hours i don't know hours the amount of time i would have probably used to braid my hair that's what i used to do in wash and go then for it to now dry three days my hair didn't dry okay i decided to use a dryer immediately i was done i was using hand dryer my hands started paining me i could not i just said oh i'm giving up i dropped the dryer and just packed the air up and slept like that that night the following day i went to class came back the second day went to class, came back. The third day, I, I kept my hair in the my hand in the middle of my head, and the crown part of my hair was still was still wet. It was still wet. Like I was like, oh no, I'm never doing this again. That was the only time I did the wash and go. So there was one thing I noticed about my edges. As you can see, I have edges. When I was natural, my edges were my hair was starting from here. Like literally, my edges were my my edges just went. I don't know how. When I was relaxed before around 2016, my hair was full to the edge. I losing my effort or somebody, and the woman was like, "Wow, I love your hair. It's full to the edge, it's like to the front." They were flourishing when I was relaxed that year. But when I went natural, 
a thing just started disappearing. In the middle of my five years, I did um, 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 dreads for about 10 or 11 months. That was around 2019. After two years of being natural, I started to do dreads for about uh, up to a year ago. That dreads, like my, my, when I now pack the dread, probably want to style it and all. My hair now starts from a year. I don't know how that happened. I don't, I don't know. I honestly don't know. And I keep moisturizing my hair. I keep using oils. I keep massaging my edges. You know, they say massage your edges. I keep doing all that. Still, it wasn't green. I relaxed my hair last year, September, October, November, December, January, four months, and I can visibly see growth in my edges. Like, see my edges, it is there, they are going back. I don't know how that happened. I have no science to explain that. But I noticed that when I was natural, my edges were going, it was cutting, it was, I don't know, it was tangling. I could just hold my, touch my edges, and I feel all those single stranded knots. Uh, but when I go, when I went relaxed, my edges are going back. And I don't do anything, I don't do anything special to the edges. And in four months, I can see a difference in my edges. That's for me, though. I don't know about any other person. I don't know how other people would, I don't know how other people's edges would react to relaxer. But mine reacts really well to relaxer. I have a video, a short video, short on how I relax my natural hair. I'm going to like make the full video and also put on yeah if you don't watch shots but you can go check out that shorts that's how i relax my hair now that's pretty much it i love the way my hair is relaxed now i don't know for other people you might not decide to go natural or i feel like if you're tired of your hair instead of just um um doing what you like or leaving the air or probably not not um doing your wash the way you would have done it not um styling your hair the way you would I've done it. I feel like just probably have a texture release. It's life is not hard. At the end, it's just a. If you don't like your hair relaxed, you can easily go back natural. I feel it's just a. I don't. I don't know. It's just a. It's not that deep. But anyways, I like my hair relaxed. My hair is. This is how my hair is. I can run my arm through it. And I wish I had done this sooner. Actually, I just wish I had done this sooner because I'm loving every bit of it. Like. I'm loving every bit of it. So, with that, we've come to the end of this video. Those are the reasons why I went not relaxed for me, why I relaxed my natural hair for me. To you, it might be different. So, thank you very, very much. Thank you very much for watching this video to the very end. Thank you for staying with me. Please, I'd like you to subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. Please subscribe to my channel. It won't cost you anything. Just click the subscribe button. And if you would like to see more of me, you'd like to see more of my pretty air, you'd like to see more of AK videos, relax air videos, just more of me in general, please turn on the post notification so you will be notified when I post a new video. Thank you very much. Love you for watching. I love you all. Bye.